up, heavy hitters? Gotta have the dad game. Cheeto's too much of a pussy to take the dad game. Too much. <laughs> Practicing for a movie role. That's why I said that. <laughs> But yeah, back to see for a new movie role that I have going on. For a movie role that I got going on. <laughs> we gotta have the free work. We gotta have the dead game. It's mandatory. Sean says I'm addicted. Maybe I am. Maybe I'm addicted. Mm-hmm. A little bit of water. Kick it off with the dead game, baby. This is the way. Oh yeah, see? I got it right this time. I think this is gonna be the best rap I ever do right here. Finally got the right rap. It's practicing to take a shit right here. Take a shit. He's aiming on it. <laughs> So what's, what's up? So we just got done, a little light sparring, a uh, little bit of bad work to warm up. But we're, we're here at Winning USA Boxing Gloves. We're gonna look for some gloves, some headgear, maybe the nut, the nut stuff, a body pad. We're, we're just gonna go get some gear, man. It's the only spot over here in Cali that sells winning stuff. Normally you gotta order it from Japan, and last time, just to get my gloves, when I got my 10 ounces for the bag and my 16 ounces to spar, it took like, I'm not kidding you, three, four months to get here. And I ordered some more, like about maybe a month ago, they're still not here, so we came here. It's hard to get here, man. You gotta call either the day before or the day of, and they're usually not here. But usually, yeah, you gotta call, make sure they're here, schedule that they're here, and then come, so. Hopefully, man, we, we can get it right here, man. I'm, I'm hoping, I'm hoping. So, that's where we at. No, he's here. Oh. Like, we have someone. Waiting to get in, waiting to get in, man. Hopefully, they got everything we need. 16 ounces, and 10 ounces, the headgear, everything. Nice to meet you, big boy. Nice to meet you. Did I see you before? Uh, no, but we, we're the ones that called, no we. Yes. Ah, are you Noi? Okay. Yes. Who is the Noi? This is the first time? First time. Okay. Yeah. Nice to meet you. I come here before. I asked him, never come back. Don't spend the money for me. I told him, I was begging him, begging him, why he's here. So this Daniel, I want, I made the appointment with you today. I told everybody, I come here everybody. I told everybody, don't come here. Don't buy, don't. Yes, oh. Then. Yeah. That's it. It's good. I never use that ring. I never know how good or how bad. Okay. That's why a lot of people say, you crazy salesman. Yes, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how good or how bad. It's the best. I only know, I only know most expensive. Yeah, it's true. But like he said, every last everything, you mm -hmm. put winning, you can tell right away, right? Yeah, winning is uh, the best. Very good. You know, I know Evo Sanchez come here sometimes. Ray Lodge come here sometimes. They told me, they told me the story. Kanemichi, I like my fighter in the winning gear. Yeah. You know Evo Sanchez mm -hmm. on the Big Bear? I never used. Yeah. I never used. Is this your first time, right? Yeah. First time? Yes. This means first time. This means pay cash. This means pay cash. I'm surprised, I'm surprised. Why? Oh, really? Why? Yeah. I don't care. My wife should kiss us like if somebody wants to sell. But at least I like to have every color, every yeah. size here. Yeah. I don't have. But why you came here first time? Because, um, why? Because I why need... you spend the gasoline to come here? <laughs> <laughs> because, uh, you I can order by internet. Yeah. You don't have to come here to see crazy salesmen in the world. Who's that? I had to meet you for the for in person <laughs> the first time. 
No, 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 no. Okay, big boy. Okay, big boy. Six, eight tons, ten, twelve, four, fourteen, six. Most popular parking grab the fourteen, sixteen, more than one full month. Nothing, nothing, empty, empty, empty. So, Tell me what do you need? Um, yes, ten ounce. Ten ounce is yeah. uh, only yes. blue. Only blue, okay. I take the blue. You sure? Yes. And then uh, 16 too. I I take white and red. Both. Why you need two? Okay, white no. and then red? Yeah. 16 ounce, okay. 16 ounce. Yes. Two large, two large, three yeah. large. Two or try, three? Try, try. Which one would you like? No, do no, you no. Think? Try, try. Okay. What color try? What color? Any color blue. Okay, come here. Try. But I never use a winning gear, okay? I told you. Yeah. I, I said to everybody, comfortable is important and then don't touch the nose. So shouldn't touch the nose first. Okay? And what then do you think? No no no. You're the boss. Oh, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. You adjust yourself, eye level, down, up, and then no no, this is not important. Okay. And then tell me, tighter or loser here? Maybe tighter Real here. Tight? Okay. Yeah. Real tight. Yeah, that's good. Uh-huh. You know the package? Mm -hmm. It bothers me. No no space here. He tight all the way. This is one flame. And then when you take off, don't put the push. Do you mind this color? No, I like the color. Okay, okay, okay. Right. The guy say make a full edge. The guy from T4. Yeah. Does it look bad like? No. Hey, we make a full edge for the what's the name? What's the name? Because yours not look Triple G? Call me. Call me from Big Bear at the airport. He's going to fight uh, Monte Carlo with the Japanese guy. Uh -huh. He said, Kazumich, do me a favor, bring the medium black, he likes black, to the airport. Oh. I said, uh, I know it, it works. You're the boss. He takes it, I'll take it. You sure? Just got a bunch of stuff from Ikea. Went to Ikea and spent two racks on Ikea. Now, we just went to the winning spot over here with Kazmichi and all the stories that Cheeto and Pat and Luke and everyone told me, it lived up to it. He's a character, 100%. But uh, gotta show respect to the OGs, been around a long time, been around a lot of, you know, all, all the top fighters ever to come up. So it was dope to at least experience that and get some gear and put the gear to use. So, um, man, you know, the biggest reason I came down was to get the headgear. Uh, I got the 3X, the biggest one. I don't even think they have it online, 3X. So I'm glad I got to get a 3X right here. Thing I need for a while, definitely don't need anything else. I ordered a couple other ones online, some, some gloves, and I got some gloves here. So I'm stocked up, man, for a while. And I got everything I needed over here. And uh, winning, man, it's the best gear you can get. So I'm excited to put it to use. Just pulled up to the pad. Got my uh, all my winning gear right here excited man to be able to use everything and you got to pay for the good for the good stuff i mean you can go get everlast gloves i see them online for super cheap maybe the cheapest ones you could probably get on everlast is a basic basic pair is probably like 20 or 30 dollars um and i know they do go up to 100 bucks or maybe 200 bucks um so they can be a little bit more pricey but you want to get the winning USA or just winning, I should say, it's winning Japan. Uh, you got to pay, man. 10 ounces more for the bag and mitts. These are, uh, what you gonna call it? These are non, non laces, obviously, it's Velcro. We got the, what is it, the cup protector? You no, know, we got the sparring gloves. We got the 16 ounces. And the sparring gloves are, are 400 bucks. So, but anyways, we put in work right here. We gotta have the 16s just like today. We moved around a little bit, nothing full blast, but we had the 16s. Look, I uh, had them out here, you see? Drying out. Drying out the 16s. It's the only bad part, even Kazmichi is like, man, you want blue? And I have black gloves, red gloves, and white gloves for sparring, and then I got the blue head here. I'm excited, and like I said, punch so much especially with the bag or you punch someone's head you know you gotta have good protection man. and this will be the first time i use a headgear every time uh, i spar 
uh, I never use a headgear. You know what I mean? So I just get punched in the face or punched in the nose or punched in the lip or whatever, whatever it is. So now it would be nice to have a little headgear, a little protection. Self and I'm investing in some winnings. They're, they're the best, best in the game. Oh yeah, I forgot I got these. New colorway, Nike Plus. New colorway, Nike Plus. So these are hard right here. But yeah, I mean, you gotta figure out, order a lot of shoes, right? Let's say this shoe is 180, anywhere uh, Air Forces are like 90 bucks. These are maybe 180. So let's say you, let's say a rough estimate, $150 average on shoes. So you could get, and look at, look at these. These things are like a rack, a thousand. And I don't really order, get these a lot, but you gotta figure, you can get, what, let's say around seven pairs. So five pairs would be, what I can't even, I'm not even doing the math. 300, four pairs would be 600. So, uh, so yeah, you get about seven pairs of Nikes, seven, you know, for one pair of Gucci. Well, it's crazy. So for me, that's why I really don't buy that designer stuff. Once in a while to treat yourself. And I saw these and they're pretty clean. They're, they're little slip-ons and they're kind of low key. And they just, you know, switch it up. And they're, and when if you're gonna wear the Gucci slip-ons, they might as well look Gucci and not look like Vans or not look like, uh, where was the Shecklers at? Oh, like this. You know what I mean? They make Gucci's that are just all red or white or black or even any any Louis Vuittons. But why wear that if you can't see the people don't know? You know, so if you get these, they're gonna know, oh okay, he's rocking the Gucci. It's not gonna do it all the time. I'd rather have the Nikes, you know, or the or the Hoka's for the running. Those have been really good for running. But yeah, I got the Nikes right here. Add to the collection. The uh, Air Max Nike Plus, they're like these right here, just a different colorway. These are one of my favorite colorways right there. I just keep those couple that I would wear, you know, here and there. And then, oh yeah, I saw these ones, 95s. I had to get them because I saw those. So look it. These are the 90s, similar colorways, the pluses, and then we got the 95s. I saw these are pretty hard. Yeah, I got these pairs. So. Hell yeah. So I got five more pairs to equal one more pair of Gucci. So I gotta go buy five more pairs of the day. We didn't get no lifting in just because half the day we spent up there in wherever it was, Redondo with uh, Kazmichi. He's a good dude and me and Noe were talking in the car. It's an experience and uh, yeah, it's just an experience. You gotta figure he's took photos originally, I don't know how much we got on camera, but uh, originally he was a photographer from Japan and he uh, photographed every top boxer there there was. Um, obviously not concurrent, but I've seen, I saw pictures of Canelo up there, so pretty pretty current. But yeah, he's taking pictures of everyone, Mike Tyson, De La Hoya, um, like Canelo, uh, Roberto Duran. He said he was going to fight Roberto Duran. He's an old, old school boxer. Uh, Holyfield. I mean, everybody's up on his wall. So to meet him, even all the uh, promoters like Don King and Dana White in the UFC, he's met every everyone. So I'm sure, you know, when let's say we go talk to Cheeto. Cheeto's met him. Cheeto has a story. Cheeto met him. And everyone has the same story. He loves to talk. He's from Japan. He, you know, so he, he's cool. He, he, he does talk a lot and maybe could rub people the wrong way, but uh, he's overall a good dude. And that's just the, the character that, that he has. So it was a good experience to meet him and uh, to listen to his stories and show him that respect and, and get some winning gloves directly from him. But doesn't mean we have to all the time. We had to drive an hour. The biggest thing was a headgear. I wanted to be there in person before. Like I said, that headgear right there is 420 bucks. So instead of just ordering it online and not getting the right size and pff, might might have to go and return it, I was like, man, let's drive up there. I'll get some more gloves, what I need, and try on the headgear, the headgear fit. And I needed to try on that uh, cup, that guard, you know.
yeah, quick little mile. That was it. We're tired today. I have some stuff I gotta do later on, so we had to just run it back, you know? So, quick little mile. Quick little mile, you know? Got it in, got it in, got, got the work in. We got a good one in, guys. We got a real good one in today. Some good training this morning. Got all laced up with the winning gear, then hit a quick mile. Usually I've been doing two miles plus stairs. Today I just hit a good mile. Like I said, we were a little crammed on time just because the whole winning thing was a lot longer than expected. But um, overall, good day. But I definitely got to fuel up on some aminos, man. I'm, I'm pretty hydrated, or dehydrated, I should say. So this is going to have your electrolytes in here as long with aminos for recovery, man. I need that recovery bad right now, so we'll go ahead. It's pretty much a full bottle, so I might put in three scoops, guys. Just depends, you don't need three scoops. If you guys wanna make it last, I mean, you're really good with one scoop, but you know, you really wanna push it, you could put two. For me, obviously, I buy all my stuff at strengthcartel.com and I stock up whenever I buy, so um, I, I, buy, I buy a lot. That's why I use three. Three in this one little bottle. But man, I'll be on my way to recovery. That's how I keep going. We've been getting cardio in pretty much. This past week or so, we've been putting in cardio like seven days. We even hit it Sunday morning. And that's uh, very rare. But usually it's at least five to six days easily of cardio. Um, that's, in, that's not including, you know, boxing or jujitsu, whatever else. So yeah so i definitely need the recovery you know <sighs> keep sipping it i think you just got back so fast <sighs> well i appreciate you guys tuning in today it was a good day i hope you guys enjoyed the kazmichi experience i know we did he's been with so many great people it was cool to meet him as well so hope you guys enjoyed that don't forget to like comment and subscribe to the channel it helps us put out these daily vlogs and bring you guys fresh content every single day. And we do drop every single day at 7 a.m., man. So put the post notifications on, set your alarm, be one of the first to watch 7, uh, 7 a.m. We do giveaways as well, at least two a month. So stay tuned for those. Uh, we've already given away a couple. So um, we just appreciate you guys, man. Thank you for watching. And don't forget, if you want your subs or your merch, get it at strengthcartel.com. Keep banging.